Hey everybody and welcome to this week's Discover Verb. I'm here with Pastor John here with Pastor Vicki. And Pastor Vicki, you uh, gave a great sermon yesterday on one of my favorite resurrection encounter stories with Jesus. You preached on Doubting Thomas, except you called him something a little different. I did. I gave him a new name. Okay, what I was bet. that name? Um, I think he. we should call him Seeking Thomas. Seeking Thomas. Much. Because it wasn't so much that he doubted Jesus. Mm -hmm. It was more of he was seeking to encounter Jesus. Okay. Because when you look at the res like all of John chapter 20, starting with Mary at the tomb, it's Mary goes to seek out Jesus, encounters him personally, and then goes to tells the disciples. Yeah. The disciples are in the locked room. They encounter the risen Jesus there. And then they go and tell Thomas as well as others. Yeah. So Thomas is then like, well, I want to see him too. Yep. So he's seeking out Jesus. He has to wait a week. <laughs> so I think he's got to wait like nine days yeah. <laughs> almost. And then Four he guys. gets to encounter Jesus himself. And then he goes and tells others. Awesome. So I don't think I think Thomas gets a bad rap for doubting. I think he is seeking Jesus, and that's a lot we can learn from him. Absolutely, I like that. I like that because mm -hmm. you know I think it's fair to say we all would have some doubts if you know we were Thomas. Like we just saw Jesus on the cross; he was dead. We watched him go into the tomb. Yep. Huh? He walked through the wall. Like what? You know, I mean, it's a lot of that stuff where make sense. it would be yeah. it would be hard. So yeah, I like that seeking Thomas. So it's probably fair to say that we were all seeking Jesus, mm -hmm. right? So I know you, and your Discover Verse very action oriented. Yeah. And the 168 hours of the week, how can we, as Discover Church individually, how can we seek Jesus mm -hmm. this week? Well, it's seeking isn't bad. Right. Seeking, I think, shows that we want to grow deeper in our faith, and we want to trust God more. Yeah. And so I challenge each one of us: is this week, whether it's in a paper journal or your favorite notes app is to write down the questions that you have for God. Is the ones that you're seeking out, how do you want to encounter the risen Jesus? Write them down and then watch and listen how God answers them. It's not going to be all like, here's the giant sure. plan for 20 years. Sure. You know, it might yeah. be step by step, yeah. but we're going to get those answers. God's going to reveal God's self to us as we seek him. Okay. So look for God. Give them the questions. God can handle it. Yeah. Watch and listen to the answers. And then as you encounter Jesus, as you have that personal experience, go tell somebody. Oh, yeah. That's what Mary did. That's what all the disciples did. That's what Thomas did. Love that. Love that. I think that's a great challenge. So, yeah, find that notebook. Find that notes app on your phone. Write those questions down, those doubts, yeah. those questions that we have for God. Write them down. Listen. Yep. Patiently. Hard part, right? That is hard. At least part, for yeah. me. But I love that ending. Share with one another. You know what? And if you don't know where to start in the sharing, you got two people right here who would love to hear what God is saying to you through the questions that you have. All right. Thank you so much, Discover Church. We'll see you again a little bit later this week.